So yeah, we you would make your sequence, hour long mm. sequence, then it would come to us on one of these. Yes. A little floppy disk which has got one megabyte, one point one megabytes of storage or one point two. Yeah. And that would come and we put it in to the machine over there. Yes. And we'd get it to also conform. Yeah, so it would tell you these three ed these edits that we've done on here, yeah. the picture ones it would say, you know, it's it's from here to here on the tape, from yeah. here to here on that tape, from here to here on that tape. And um, take those bits. And it's magic the way you could do it. You could, you could do, we would do either an A mode conform or a C mode conform. Yes. So an A mode conform would be completely linearly. Yeah. And we would keep changing the tapes and put them in and out. Or they do a C mode. Yeah. Whereas it would come from the source tape only. Yeah. And it would run up and down the timeline of taking all the shots from, from that, that tape. one tape. Yeah. And drop them in exactly the right place. Yeah. Um, and, and also, I mean, it was very, very clever. The, uh, the program behind it is amazing. That you'd then go, okay, while one tape was being laid on the timeline, it would then start spooling either the second tape or it would eject the second tape and ask for the third tape to go in. 